Hi guys, how are you? Welcome back. This is Ernest Bonifas Makulo EBM and today I'm going to talk about specifically PhD fully funded programs in the United States of America and today is full funded programs in the field of biology. Those who are taking science programs today is your lucky day because I have specifically PhD programs fully funded everything paid, tuition fees, stipend cost for living, everything paid if you want to study in America. Stay with me and you'll be able to see these programs. In case you haven't watched any of the PhD programs full funded in the US, here I, I will put at the end of this video, I will post some of these fully funded programs like suggested videos here and there. Or overall, how to get scholarships, you will see all those videos. But before we start, one thing from you again, remember to subscribe here on my channel. If you subscribe, it gives me more energy to be able to put more videos here and my goal is to put more videos more educative videos which are very very helpful for you to be able for you to succeed okay let's go i said i'll be reading some of these when they are here so don't get frustrated with me in case i don't pronounce things as they're supposed to be because english is not my language i just came to learn this language and i hope i'll be able to pronounce some of the names so when I'm saying full funding or full funded programs, I mean you are getting tuition paid, fees paid, cost of living. Uh, by cost of living, that means you are given maybe 1500 or 2000 for you get apartment. Then you'll be getting some money for uh, the money we'll be using. That one will be used for food and a few other things. So. That is about full funding programs. And most of the PhD programs in the US, usual, they're about five years compared to most of the PhD programs in Europe. Okay, because here you do PhD by coursework and not just the PhD by thesis as in Europe. Here you just go in the class, do every work, and then you do your comprehensive exam, and then you go to do the PhD uh, thesis, whatever you finish there. So it is a little bit longer. It goes in many cases above three years. So, okay, let's go on. So. There are a couple universities here. These are not only the universities. These are few universities out of so many universities which provide full funding programs in the study of biology. Okay, the first university is university. Okay, Arizona State University. Arizona State University is in the great state of Arizona. Yes, it is in Tempe, Arizona. It says as, as, as follows, we guarantee, read the word guarantee, we guarantee, so it is there for you. We guarantee five years of academic year funding as a teaching or research assistant. When we say teaching assistant, that means you will be assisting teaching or you'll be assisting on research. In many countries, we call tutorial assistant, TA. Oh, while I was in Tanzania with these people, we used to call them seminar leaders. They assist seminars. So you assist either teaching, you assist your research in the department, and then they'll be paying for your education. Okay, so this is a little bit different from Europe. Europe is called scholarship. Here we call assistantship. So you will be guaranteed to be given five years of academic funding as a teaching or research assistant. This includes, listen, includes insurance, stipend, and tuition support to cover the required 84 hours for your degree. So, Eight hours of eight, eight, eight or four hours. That means eight or four hours is for full credit hours for the PhD. So that is number one. Okay, that is Arizona State University, which guarantees you five years of your studies up to eight or four credit hours, covering stipend, tuition fees, 
insurance, all this uh, stuff which you needed to have. So that is Arizona State University is in the Tempe, Arizona. Then let's go to another university. We are going to the Boston University. Uh, so Boston University is having what we call a uh, PhD in medical, uh, biometric, bio, biomedical, biomedical sciences. It is in Boston, Massachusetts. This is one of the states, I mean, when I, when I was when I came to America to pronounce the word Massachusetts was a little bit difficult, but now it's just normal. Okay, so biomedical sciences students receive full tuition coverage, fees, health insurance options, and a, up to a thirty five thousand stipend per year. Remember, Boston is a little bit more expensive compared to Tampa, Arizona. So, thirty five thousand stipend per year. Uh, plus everything is paid. So your job is to apply and get in. And I will talk about the overall application to apply to study in PhD in America. But just know that Boston University has a full funded program in uh, biomedical sciences. Then we go to Duke University is in North Carolina. For those who follow college basketball, you know uh, how Duke was, I mean, the, um, how basketball uh, Duke University is. Okay, so Duke University in North Carolina, the graduate school expects that PhD students will be financially supported for the majority of the time they are registered and working towards their degree. Generally speaking, PhD students should receive payment of tuition, a stipend, and fees supporting for a minimum of five years, as well as health insurance for six years. Okay. Already guaranteed, as I said. Then let's go to another university. What other the best? Uh, what other university than the best university on the planet Earth? Harvard. For those who want to go to Harvard University, okay, it is in Boston. Okay, Boston, Massachusetts. That is where Harvard is. Okay, PhD in Biological Sciences in Public Health. Okay, all students, all students admitted. That means your job is just to get admitted at Harvard. So all students admitted to the PhD in Biological Sciences in Public Health Program, including international students, are guaranteed full funding, which includes a stipend, tuition, health insurance for five years, provided they maintain satisfactory progress. Your job is get admitted at Harvard, public health, and maintain the GPA which is required to be student there. You'll be getting all those stuff. Okay, another university is MIT, Massachusetts Institute of Technology. Massachusetts also in the great state of Massachusetts. Okay, MIT, Cambridge, Massachusetts. Okay, all graduate students receive full tuition coverage, a stipend to cover living expenses, and individual health insurance. So just get your job to get admitted at MIT. You'll be good to go. Okay, another university, Mayo Clinic College of Medicine and Science. It is in Minnesota, Rochester, Minnesota. Our PhD program in biomedical science Biomedical science includes an annual graduate level stipend, full tuition, and travel expenses to scientific meetings provided by the mentors. Your job again is to get to admitted at a Mayo Clinic College of Medi Medicine and uh, Medicine Science. Okay, University of California, Irvine. In Irvine, California, it is in Southern California, one of the beautiful area in America. Southern California is very, very beautiful. And the uh, UC, uh, UC system, University of California, is one of the big universities, but this is UC Irvine. So stu students admitted to the doctoral programs in the School of Bi Biological Sciences are offered full financial support as long as they are making satisfactory progress, including uh, a generosity, a generous stipend, fees, non-residence tuition, and health insurance. Okay, let's go to another university, University of Pittsburgh. University of Pittsburgh, it is in Pittsburgh, Pennsylvania. Okay. 
the normal level of support, for instance, for the fall 2019, those who started this year, but just each year is the same, but they will be increasing because the cost of living will be changing. So those who are admitted, for instance, for this year, they are getting 29,520 per year. That is a stipend for annual typical, but it is increasing each year by 3 to 5%. So this is the just example for this year, but it will be increasing each year because obvious inflation and all other cost of living will be changing. So next year it will be three to five percent is increasing a stipend. But again, the cost of living, I mean uh, tuition fees, everything is already paid for. The University of Pittsburgh provides excellent health insurance option and the tuition waivers. Your job is to get admitted at that university. Then, let's go to the University of Southern California. Okay, University of Southern California. It is in Southern California. Again, uh, it is in LA area, Los Angeles area. PhD students receive full funding throughout their studies, including stipend, health insurance, and dental benefits. Just get admitted at USC, University of Southern California. Again, University of Utah, Salt Lake City in Utah. PhD students receive full funding throughout their studies, including stipend uh, 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 for five years, guaranteed. Doctoral students are guaranteed to receive five years of st uh, stipend support at about 28,000 a year through a combination of research assistantships, training grants, and teaching assistantships. In addition to the annual stipend, support for doctoral students included tuition and health insurance. Remember, Utah is not that expensive compared if you get into Boston, an area like Boston, or like if you are going to uh, LA area. So, apply to the University of Utah. Okay, Van, I don't know, this is called... Uh, Van Endo Institute of Graduate School, PhD in Molecular and Cellular Biology. Uh, it's in Grand Rapids, uh, uh, Michigan. Students in the doctoral program at the graduate school are supported uh, by institutional internal fellowships for five years. These fellowships include a stipend of approximately 35000 per year and health, dental, and vision insurance for the study and the family oh this is very good for the student and the family for five years uh 35,000 that is a very good one for the doctoral and plus it is in Grand Rapids so it's not that expensive so that is a very good one graduate school also provides a laptop computer and up to 2,000 per year to attend scientific conferences that is a very good one so just apply so those are some of the graduate programs in Biology. You can find other programs in the United States of America if you want to get into biology or science of that kind of nature. So your job is just to apply and get admitted to various universities. But I said, in order to apply for PhD in the US, there are a couple of things. Obviously, if you're international students, there is a procedure you have to take the English proficiency test, test of English as a foreign language 12, or International English Language Testing System, ILTS. That's number one. Secondly, you have to take GRE or GMAT. So for this case, GMAT is for management, graduate management admission test. So you don't take GMAT because this is biology. So some of the universities, they have what they call GRE by subject. But there is graduate record examination, GRI general, and the subject. So some of the universities in science programs, they have specifically uh, subject examination. So your job is to make sure that before you apply, check with the university if they want GRI general or GRI subject. So that is your job and get admission. So I put here a lot of suggested videos on how to apply PhD programs. Oh, this is what should you take uh, ILTS or should you take the 12th? So there is a playlist suggested videos about education just check them out and you'll be able to do that but otherwise remember to subscribe to my youtube channel and i'll appreciate that what else do you need from me more videos i'll provide that i'll make sure that you get a scholarship if you have any question if you have don't understand any procedure in the united states of america how to apply how to get scholarships 
I'll be able to help you. Most of these scholarship, uh, this one they give you at least twenty five thousand per year. So if you are going for five years, it's more than a hundred thousand per year. So this is not about asking for the sympathy. It is a competitive capitalism. Make sure that you go full force competing. What else? Make a comment about what video you want me to up, uh, to what topic you want me to uh, to to make. I'll be able to provide that kind of topic if I know it. Good to go. Thank you, everyone, and enjoy the rest of your day. And I wish you all the best in application for scholarships, PhD. There are so many other PhD in other countries, but this was specifically PhD programs in the United States of America, everyone. Goodbye.